So Johnny Cage has been confirmed as expected in a tweet by Ed Boon where he appears to be flipping somebody off. Now the most evident signal that indicates it's definitely Johnny Cage is the outfit including the black gloves and the brown sleeveless jacket which Johnny appeared to have been wearing in previous leaks. But as I said, the news comes as no surprise because Johnny Cage has participated in pretty much every Mortal Kombat installment. However, more interesting leaks concerning MK11's guest characters have emerged and this time there have been talks about Bayonetta. Dance boy. This news emerged after Bayonetta's director Hideki Kamiya tweeted a very short post which simply said Mortal Kombat x Bayonetta. Now the tweet has since been deleted, but I personally think that Kamiya might have tried to snowball a new trend similar to the one we saw with Shaggy and all the memes that followed. But remember, despite being featured in Super Smash Bros, Bayonetta is no stranger to blood and violence in her own series, which means that unlike other characters, the likelihood of her being featured at least in the future is not actually very low. I personally would prefer a horror character, but bringing something unexpectedly new is cool and this opens the door for more guest characters to join the combat roster instead of just being limited to horror icons. Also in the news, we have Shinnok. In the official PlayStation Europe magazine, Shinnok appears to have been accidentally revealed, but the only problem with that is that the article in which he appears describes him as being a victim of Gera's fatality. But the one who actually appears in the picture is Sub-Zero and not Shinnok, which led many to believe that this is a mere mistake. In addition, Shinnok already appeared in the prologue and he's definitely in Mortal Kombat 11. But will he be a playable character? I highly doubt it. The positive side to all of this is that in case he really is a playable character, you'll get to play a super villain fight between Shao Kahn and Shinnok for the first time after all these years. Now finally it ends. Last but not least, there have been talks about a new male character who has been leaked through an interview with Junior Nanetti, who is the Brazilian voice actor for Baraka. When asked about his favorite fighter, he said that it was a male character that has not been revealed yet. Now the interview in question has since been deleted because assumingly too much information was made known. But anyways, we're just a month away from the official release of the beta version for those who pre-ordered the game and until then, I'm sure we'll have lots of reveals, leaks and much more. As usual, let me guys know what you make of these leaks. For more, make sure to like the video and subscribe to Gamelution.